we now return to Let's Play Zeus. Music is always so ominous when I start up again. Okay, so we definitely have a need for people. And uh, we're kind of getting there. We need more fleece is one of the major issues. And uh, now that we're not selling it, I guess they're going to come out here to grab this. We need fleece. Time to buy some more. Yep, and that's it. Alright. So now if I have him accepting to here, is he just going to wander... What? Off I go to thrill all of Greece with my emotions. There must be a game on that I was not paying attention to. So they are bringing some here. Um, but is this shortening the distance? I guess the real key here is to uh, come over here and see how much is in storage. It just says it holds 500, but it's not... Oh no, that is the current holding. Okay, so yes, the issue there is not that we are not producing enough fleece, it's that it's taking too long to get to market. That is currently an issue for both of these. We do not have the ability to move that fast enough, but hopefully because I'm seeing these guys show up here a lot more frequently. I assume they're all... nope. Well, one is. What are you? Okay, so two are going there. So yeah, definitely, because by the time these guys get here, then this guy's almost back, ready for another load. So this should definitely help. Um, okay, 28. We still got 200 people. Okay, so we've got it. We've actually got more than I had thought. Um, this is just because we are having access along the back to the theater. Um, so these guys up here will not evolve, so that's going to limit just a bit uh, of what we've got. And I'm afraid that by the time more fleece shows up here, uh, we're going to lose some more of these homes. Where, where is that? Would that be? That's not under husbandry? Sure, surely it's not. Uh, I guess I'm looking at supply here. Okay. So they do actually have fleece. I guess I could click on one, but only two. Like, they're, they're going to run out of that pretty darn quick. Especially with this massive influx of people. Okay, I'm going to pause for a moment, though, because now that we've got all these people, we can actually put them to work in something a little bit more useful. Now, I was thinking about this, putting down all the temples that I was talking about previously, and how that may not be such a great idea. Because it's going to take up a lot of people. Like, a lot of people, in order to have ourselves one of these temples, but I think overall this is a better idea and you know, you think about the trade-off in money, once we've got the armor, we've got the armor so that's really where we're at there that expense would be gone once we do that um, but the idea I think is that we, well actually we can only sell bronze right? to our rivals no, Egypt will buy armor, okay so we do have bronze and armor markets after this, so definitely bronze. Okay, so I think we'll just do that, um, because this will be sustainable eventually. So the question is, do I just plunk this down and do whatever with it, or do I try to make it a little bit more appealing? And I think I like the idea of trying to make this look a little bit better, just because it's going to be out here and uh, we kind of need this to fit in, I suppose. Um, so, I'm really not utilizing this part. I was thinking of just putting industry along this road so that everyone has to kind of deal with it. Maybe we'll just jut something out here so they can... Well, so here's another thing too to consider is that it's going to take forever for the priests to wander all the way over here to get sacrificial offerings for the gods. So, I mean, there's really no other place to put Hephaestus. Um, so we'll just go ahead and plunk him down here, I suppose. Do I... Nah, we'll just leave this. We'll just leave it. I was thinking of maybe cordoning this off uh, with some walls, but I think for this we will just leave it. I'm going to have to delete a little bit of the forest out here. No! Hopefully that will develop into a, uh... Oh, come on. 
it'll develop into a uh, an ore deposit there so we're just going to beautify that um, and then eventually I think I do want to kind of surround this but for now we'll just let it go it's right there because they should still be able to get here so now if I'm going to have industry and this might be It'll be a little premature for me to do that. But to get industry, I'll probably want something right here at the end. I don't think the temple's going to collapse, so having this here right now is actually kind of unnecessary. Um, we'll just let him wander as far as he will go. He'll probably end up like midway here. Not even. He ended up at that tree there. So I can't really utilize him as a double to get over here for anything if I ever expand to that. But along here, I don't know. Maybe maybe for role-playing purposes we won't just fill this with dirty industry as everyone walks in. They'll walk by the Temple of Hephaestus and all its splendor, but we'll end up putting a little elbow out here where the, uh, the actual industries will go so that he hopefully wanders over here to bless them. One, two, three. Good. I uh, appear to have measured that out correctly. And maybe I will just circle it around and we'll just have something out here. I can block it off so that even as this guy walks out here, he'll walk back to the shortest path around it and it'll just be for aesthetic purposes. Yeah, he'll make it. Okay, cool. So now we actually have to, in order to make this work, we have to have some guild homes. Uh, this is going to require marble, and lots of marble, and some sculptures, and loads of wood. So we're kind of kind of hard up there now that I think about it, because we are not going to be able to just get... Okay, Phoenicia will give me the sculpture as well as the armor. Okay. So I'm going to need a whopping... Six sculpture. May as well buy them now. We won't worry about being profitable every year. We'll just do it as we need to. Well, this seems to be sustainable. That's pretty good. The market now has plenty of fleece, as does this one. Good. Good. So this has worked out quite well. Uh, we are getting a small amount of stockpile. A little bit here. So it is moving to where it needs to. That's good. That is good. So let's see here, we're at 190%, okay. Man, I'm still just blown away at how how crazy that is. So we need olive oil. Uh, something I cannot produce for myself once again. My dearest, worship me, and I'll make your soldiers find great strength. So now who is the one? Larissa, I suppose, huh? No, they don't actually. Uh, well, I guess we're going to have to have Thebes, because Thebes will provide only wine, though. My Cine. So we're pretty much going to have a full docks here, then. Yeah. I'm surprised we can't even produce our own wood, though. That seems a little... Low. So we need a Mycenae, and we need a Thebes, as well as our Larissa and Phoenicia. So let's get that going. Yeah, this is what I thought was going to happen. Well, it's either that or come down here and maybe... Well, we could build one. Which, uh, we could put uh, Phoenicia here. We wouldn't be able to get to it very easily unless I turn that into an avenue which I could do, but then we would specifically have this... Well, you know, that might work out. That might actually work out. Except that my exportation of... Okay, we can stop buying that. Yeah, we couldn't really export anything here. So I'd be able to get my bronze and my sculpture and all that stuff here, which would eventually become self-sustaining, so it's completely unnecessary to even have it there. Never mind. Um... Okay, well, let's just plunk these down to here, and to not Egypt, not, fuck, come on, there. Give me my road, and we will 
And I guess I could do that. A little less crazy road. And it gives me room for something. Not sure what I'd put in there, frankly. But uh, we can at least maybe make this look a little nicer down here. Because we're looking at maybe... Well, a 1-2 and a 1-2, so why don't we do kind of something like that. And then we'll put a f gazebo. Sure, those workers need a nice little place to go and rest. That gives me also a flower garden here. I won't do it here because I might actually... There. And then we'll do some Doric columns. Entering in. That'll be nice. Is he, is he actually making it all the way? I mean, he should be, for crying out loud. It's a short run. Good. Okay. So we'll just have this hanging out on the docks for a moment, because I don't really need them. And we appear to be filling this in quite nicely. We are having the water crisis. This is not good. It's a constant fluctuation of people when it does that, and I don't know why it does it. Because it seemed, initially, that it was going just fine. It was hitting everything it needed to. And now it's not. So, uh, what else? You guys are complaining about culture, but you guys are complaining about olive oil. Well, once again, I don't know that I actually want olive oil My here. I think I'll maybe just I'll keep it on this side until we're sure we absolutely sleep. need all this... All this stuff. Um... God, yeah, that sucks that we can't make our own wood, either. That's very expensive. In fact, uh, we are losing a ton of money here. Import cost? Well, okay, so... That was all... That was all this. Maybe we will just run at 100%. This is going really damn slow. Food is maintaining, but we should probably actually start thinking about that. I'm going to pause for a moment here, and we're finally going to get in on this. So, how is this going to work? I could just run a big long road, but that's also probably not the best way to handle this. Uh, if I wanted a temple to Demeter, that would be at the end of this, which would actually be very appropriate, because this would be basically at the end of all the meadow. Um, alternatively, if I turned it this way, it would not fit, so it's got to go that way. And it will terminate here. So I guess we could have sort of a winding path, a uh, winding pilgrim's path to Demeter's temple, although it looks like if I drew a road right from here straight, it would come along the edge of her temple. And then maybe I could build a loop inside here to get all the farms rather than one jagged winding path all the way. That, okay, I'm down for that. 27, though. We spent a lot of money this year, and the year's not even over. Well, I guess that was last year, still, though. Uh, so what are, we, what are we hanging on to? 24? Excellent. So one year plus the... Uh, one year plus what we've already got in there is going to do it. So... A year of buying that, but that means we can go ahead and anticipate that this will be here already. Uh, we should probably put a block there. Have to be I mean, be? you know, know, well, see, because here's the thing. This guy isn't going to make it much further. He, he makes it to right about here, so he would make it to right about here, which is not... Well, I, now that I say that, I was going to say that's not enough for him to loop, but if he came here... Maybe a road this way would be the shorter way, and he would return through all of my my farms. Because I can actually get quite a bit, but if I do one on the outside, two on the inside, and one out... Alright, we're going to have to... Uh, and I'll make your soldiers find well, great maybe strength. not there, but how about there? And we'll have to clear out this. Let's clear out to there. Okay. I want to destroy all the trees because, again, we kind of need something. Oh, my. Well, that came quick. That's what she said. Um, all right, well, I guess we can put down the Garden of Demeter. Now, if I put down 
Can I... Oh, there. okay, yeah, so you can halt construction. I was going to say, if I do this, then they're going to be splitting their attentions. But uh, this will at least allow me to set things up for a moment. Garden of Demeter. Yeah, it's just going to completely block off this end of the island, but that's okay, we can access it from the back here if we really need to. Because there's, there's literally no other way this fits on here. Yeah. And uh, from the... Huh? Huh? Oh, dummy. Okay. 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 We can go back to selling this now. Um, and that's okay too, because then I can maybe. Uh, let's accept half, so it has a supply here, and then I'm gonna want just four. Just four. Let's see this work. Oh, what? You already took it and now you're... Uh, so it doesn't... Does this count? Now that you've taken it? Why would it take off extra to... Uh, so I need to import four more, though. Right? Let's wait on this, because I'm really going to have to... Okay, that was not the one. Okay, you see the problem here? They're putting too much in this, so... Let's do, like, eight at a time, and they'll just have to be here three times a year. Which I think we can do sufficiently. So who's coming here? Where's the damn ship? I should be buying more. I've still got capacity here, right? Okay, so what the hell... What is going on there? Yeah, I still don't have enough. I guess we'll just take all the goddamn marble then. What the hell is going on? There, and you gave me too much. Good grief. Okay, now we can put this down. There we go. So that, oh man, that's actually going to be, that's going to be quite a healthy distance away from that, isn't it? Well, that's okay. Uh, so we will just knock out some of those trees. And have this run up the front. And of course make it very nice looking. Okay. So yeah, I could put something along here. Maybe run columns along the side of this. That could look cool. We'll figure out what we're going to do to beautify that later. I'm going to halt construction right now on this. And this is going to be a very expensive thing to do. Uh, just because of the importation of all of my marble that will be required for this, because not only does it need the footprint, but it's also going to require a ton more on top of the wood, on top of the sculpture. So, uh, I'm going to consume some people here, and we're just going to put it right here along this road. Well, okay, we'll put it right here along this road. I mean, I'm going to remove these eventually anyway. They take up 25 people? My god, we got a ton. 25 people. That's That didn't even do a dent in this. That's pretty bad. Um, so now we need to think higher about exportation. Um, our exporting game is a little bit low. We're going to need that. And we're going to probably need wine. So we may as well get that started. And what do we got here? I was going to break this into bits, which it's got. Okay. So in that 
situation, I guess then we really only need four at a time. It will purchase all of them, but it'll trickle it in a little bit better. The real money on this colony is not going to come about until long after we have... Uh, I was just checking my food supplies here. Till long after we have done uh, some things. They need some fleece. Okay. So this might be a situation where I don't want those truncated. Uh, trade changes. Should probably have those. Should probably have these. If tribute is a thing for me, it's probably not really... Um, okay, let me look at my messages here. Olympian Games conclude. We lost. That's why all those people are coming back. But, uh, okay, anyway. So we have... We don't have enough. We don't have enough. How is that possible? I, I know. I'm gonna get there. Someone's gonna come in eventually and save the day for me, right? We are going at 100. What the hell? Once again, the water. Ah, oh, that is aggravating. Because, I mean, that's a massive fluctuation in population when it does that. It might actually just be better for me to knock out one of these and put a second fountain in. Oh my, I was not anticipating that just yet. Um... Okay. High unemployment is a problem and hygiene is deteriorating. Oh, because I've not put a hygiene thing over here, have I? No, I have not. Well, that solves this issue of... No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. I'm going to have to put something like this. Alternatively, I can put it right next to this person's house. They will love it. Or I can kick this out which I'm feeling better about because it actually has this structure to oppose the appeal issue. It's just that we've got the college right next to the podium. Eh, whatever. The alternative is that we start digging up appeal buildings that would allow me to combat the poor appeal of this. Uh, I do have another statue that I could put right in there. I don't know, the monuments, they're really effective, but just, uh, they're really out of place. I'll put that there, but, you know, like, I don't want to just use those as the main source of everything. And what is going on here? Um, so, you know, flipping these over. I do kind of like the big garden thing, too. Well, let's just go ahead and do that. That's, uh... I'm sure this is going to have a bigger impact on the appeal of this area than I would otherwise anticipate. But I guess I can put it, the garden thing over there. Sure. Um, this noble is just going to have to deal with the fact that there is a big, disgusting infirmary right behind their house. see what this did to appeal. Okay, good. It's offsetting it. Um, there. I want to be able to see stuff. So, fleece. Now, this is not enough fleece production, apparently, for the, uh, well, okay. We ne actually need to stop selling, um, is the actual thing. That would be why. We do not have enough production for my population and to sell. So obviously the answer there My truly quest. is going to be and I'll make your soldiers find great this. Putting this on Sheep Island. And how's food? That's still, oh yeah, okay. It's time to deal with that before I got interrupted there with uh, everything just collapsing. Let's get in here with some farms and now think about how this loop is going to go. So, we've got one, two, three, road. One, two, three, one, two, three, road. That basically means I won't be able to put anything on this side until it's over here. So, I'm pretty much going to have to. So 
So what I could do instead is an L shape. So we actually have one, two, three, one, two, three road going here. Then I have one on this side. And then one, two, three, one, two, three here. So it looks something like that. And uh, then it would kind of come in this way, wherever that road is going to go. Um, I think if I remove this stuff, I would, in fact, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So I would not actually be able to get the road there. So if I did one, two, three, uh, but then I wouldn't be able to put a road here because then it's going to make this off. I mean, I would like a little bit of greenery, but I think we're just going to have to wipe that out. Anyway, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So probably here, which actually works out okay for that. Um, so let's put in some farms. Okay, so in order to make this loop work, we're gonna have to do this, send him up here to a point where he'll move over and come back this way. So let's see, first of all, where he even goes. He can go all the way up. Okay, cool. Well, in that case, now we need to look at, and I just realized that there's gonna be a lot of dead space, right? Well, here anyway. We can we can do, a, how about a happiness monument? Just out in the middle of the, now that looks stupid. Let's do park. Big ol' park right there, cool. So then we're looking at one, two, three, one, two, three. Say a road here, and then we have one, two, three, because otherwise we'd be doing one, two, three, one, two, three with a road up the back, but it might be too far and he'd start turning around. So we're probably not going to need this much, but uh, we'll find out. If you worship me, traders will find travel to the city easy. Uh, shit. That is not working. Okay, well, I guess that means then that we now... Uh, we have to lower our expectations of what we're going to get out of this. I could just make a little loop. But let's see what happens when I do one, two, three, and then drag this here. I'm not sure that this gains me one, two, three, four, as opposed to one, two, three, four, five. So it gains me one more on this end. Um, it would also gain me four here, and we're looking at one, two, three? Because of this. But I could have it jut out here. So it's the same amount, but one more inside this. All right, let's take a look. Ah, oh, you bastard. There he goes. What the? Okay, we need to stop that. And we can get rid of that. There you go. We have solved the problem. And then, of course, we can put... What the hell? I don't understand. Why does it go one time, and then it doesn't go the other time? Life doesn't have to be unpleasant. Worship me, and find out. I mean, would it be cleaner to have him go this way, but then we can't stop him from going down the bridge? Okay, I don't get what's going on there, but... Anyway, and now there's no place to take the wheat, so, um, because it's all been taken here. Well, we definitely need to tell this to get, and I don't think there's any way we can export this, is there? Uh, was it Egypt? I think maybe Egypt likes, get out of there, likes wheat. Phoenicia, Egypt, nope. Nope. Absolutely no use for the wheat at all, aside from feeding my own people. So really, four is all we need, um, I would say, for quite some time. So that seems to make this very superfluous, uh, seeing how uh, all of this is kind of the, the main thing here. We have gotten nothing 
down here, and uh, that's largely because I'm not importing marble. No, I am. No, I'm not. All right. Well, before I uh, make that decision, I'm probably also going to want to open a storehouse specifically for that. specifically supply this, and then we'll just remove it once it's bu all built and everything. Um, but yeah, okay, well, this fluctuation thing is weird from time to time, but it seems to have stabilized quite a bit, and I hate to just buy the armor now. I can set this aside. I don't think... I could just set it, a set it aside, just plain and simple, and I really didn't even need to buy it, because that's that's too much. Um, ah. Oh, we're gonna need tons, because not only do we need to supply them, but then we have to have a full storehouse of it on its own. Oh boy. This is gonna take a lot of effort, isn't it? We're still very low on... Uh, but then again, I think these guys do take a low amount of this stuff, so I'm not actually super concerned with that. Having these guys eat up some of it, eh, that's not such a great thing either, but uh, I mean, money-wise, we seem to be doing okay. Uh, we have full storehouses, and the supply now for food is good. Uh, more than good, in fact. We're going to have excess for quite some time. So, yeah. So really, I could have just done what I said and just had one winding road with these on either side of it. And it would have been just fine. Oh well, live and learn. Anyway, probably time to end this one here. I will see you next time.